Next article. Hundreds of thousands of babies are on antidepressants and psychotropic drugs. This is by Vic Bishop. Like modern pharmaceuticals to regulate their emotional and spiritual well-being by tinkering with their body and brain chemistry. Psychotropics are chemical pharmaceuticals that change brain chemistry and create alterations in mood, consciousness, and perception. Whatever your opinion of them is, they are here to stay in our society, and they have extremely negative side effects, and they've even been linked to very shocking incidents of public violence and school shooting. Numbers gathered in 2013 show that even the youngest members of our society are being drugged with psychotropic medications, begging the question of how we should responsibly and ethically address child behavior in our society. According to the 2013 data, over a half million, 500,000 very young children are currently taking mind-altering medications with over a quarter of a million infants from zero to one years of old included on that list. An analysis of the 2003 data found that over 274,000 infants from zero to one years of old and some 370,000 toddlers, one to three years of age, in the U.S. were giving Xanax and antidepressant Prozac. This report also found over 1,400 infants were on ADHD methylen, which is, which is, which is, which is methylphenidate, which is like speed drugs. The numbers of this survey suggest that around 10,000 infants are taking drugs for ADHD, but some say these estimates are far too low and that in reality millions of children nationwide are taking the medications, and that doesn't even include the teenagers, the millions and millions of those who have been linked to school shootings and to violence by taking drugs. Guys, what do you think about this? I mean, babies? Zero? I mean, one-month-old baby being given Prozac? 